following program is a presentation of the Hilltopper Sports Satellite Network, produced by Hilltopper IMG Sports Marketing. WKUPBS will return to this channel at the conclusion of the program. Coach's Corner with Jeff Brom is brought to you by Bluegrass Cellular, the official wireless sponsor of WKU Athletics. Bluegrass Cellular, your community expanded. Interventional pain specialist. Pain is inevitable, suffering is optional. Pizza Hut, home of the big dinner box. Make it great. Taco Bell, Taco Bell's new dollar cravings menu. Taco Bell, because sometimes you gotta live moss. Toyota Bowling Green, we take care of people. UPS. Today's logistics of the game are delivered by UPS. Information about how UPS can put the power of logistics to work for you at thenewlogistics.com and by WKONA. Nowhere to go. Welcome to the Coach's Corner, presented by Bluegrass Cellular. Your community expanded with Coach Jeff Brom. Coach, disappointing loss, 45 to 38 to FAU. Yes, it was. Uh, you know, it was kind of a repeat of uh, a couple of games before, and uh, it's happened quite a bit this season. But, you know, we started off strong. We played well. Our guys came ready to play. Uh, we fought hard the first half and, uh, and had a very uh, good lead uh, going into halftime and realized what we needed to do. You know, it's happened before, coming out in the second half and talked about it and stressed it for a couple of weeks, and unfortunately it happened again and uh, didn't play well the second half. I think they scored every time they touched the ball, and, and uh, a few times we got it, we weren't able to get things going. So, yeah, disappointing loss and definitely one that hurts. Coach, at, at this point in time, what is, how is the morale with the coaches and the players? Well, it's not fun when you lose, and especially when you lose that way, when you're close, when you have a chance. Not only have a chance, but you, you're in command of the game. Uh, so, you know, in times like these, you've got to just decide whether you're willing to fight or not. And I think, uh, you know, as coaches and players, we are willing to fight the fight. And it's going to be a, a tough one because uh, things have kind of repeated itself uh, for a couple of weeks now. And we've got to learn how to get over the hump, how to find a way to uh, play a full game. And uh, we've got to go back to work. And, Coach, like you start off uh, so well in the beginning. No, it's gone well. Like I said, you know, I, I'm happy with the way that we come ready to play. Uh, we, we, we do a very good job in the first half. We make plays. We score points. Uh, our defense played better in the first half. Uh, and, and, and things were going well. And uh, just when you think you're kind of getting over the hump, the second half comes along and, and uh, you know, uh, the things are reversed. So not a good second half. We've got to fight through it. Uh, but we've got to be willing to do whatever it takes to get it done. Okay, Coach, we're going to take a quick break. We'll be back to you after these messages. This Conference USA report is brought to you by HitSense, the exclusive presenter of WKU's inaugural Conference USA season. HitSense, dream it real. When you're part of a community, you feel empowered, like you can handle anything, because no matter what happens, you have the support of those around you people who genuinely care. With Bluegrass Cellular's 4G nationwide coverage and all the latest smartphones and devices, you can go anywhere and do anything because your community will be with you, supporting you every step of the way. Bluegrass Cellular, your community, expanded. Got him in group as a go. Oh. Yes! <laughs> Not just a startup, an upstart. <sighs> Gotta get going. Gotta be good. Good? Good. Growth is the goal. How do we do that? I talked to UPS. They'll help us out. New technology, smart advice. We focus on the business, and they take care of the logistics. UPS. Good going. We get good? That's great. 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 <laughs> I love logistics. This year, when you play Monopoly at McDonald's, you're playing for more than $1 million. You're playing for greatness. The game you love is back. Play Monopoly at McDonald's for your shot at millions of prizes, including a one-on-one -on -one experience with LeBron James, Patrick Kane, Jamie McMurray, or Alex Morgan. So, what are you waiting for? Let's play this game. Yeah, I just picked her up. We should be there. 
there in 20 minutes. Who is it? Oh, it's him. <gasps> Where is he? I know. Yeah, I know. Western Kentucky students, parents, alumni, and fans, we have the exclusive WKU debit card available for you. Open a regular checking account with South Central Bank and ask for one today. We are South Central Bank, small enough to know you, WKU fans. And big enough to help. We now offer e-statements, mobile banking, and remember the official debit card of WKU Athletics. Get yours today at any South Central Bank location. Member FDIC, Equal Housing Lender. If you are one of the 100 million Americans who suffer from chronic pain and are frustrated with treatments that don't provide lasting relief, let the team of professionals with interventional pain specialists help you get back to life. Understanding the physical, psychological, and emotional toll pain can have on your life, their multidisciplinary care is personalized specifically to your unique case, customizing your treatment plan to deliver the best possible outcome. Make your appointment to visit the interventional pain specialists today. This week's injury update is brought to you by WKONA. They want you to know where to go. Welcome back to the Coach's Corner, presented by Bluegrass Cellular, the official wireless sponsor of WKU Athletics. Coach, the first half dynamic, and then what happened in the second half? Well, I think the second half on defense, obviously, we weren't able to stop them. I think that uh, we got them in some manageable third downs, even fourth downs, where uh, we just need to get a stop. And uh, they were able to convert almost all those situations, which hurt us. Uh, on offense, they started to press us up a little bit more, really uh, uh, take away our short throws and get up in our face and, and play man-to-man -man coverage. And we weren't as good at getting some separation and getting open and making the plays. So combination of those things, uh, they had the momentum. Uh, and it just kind of uh, multiplied and we weren't able to overcome it. Coach, what is it that these, the team FAU did in the second half to make the adjustments? Well, I don't really know if it's a whole lot of what they did uh, on offense. I think that, uh, you know, we need to tighten some things up uh, in third down situations. We need to tighten some things up in fourth down situations and really make them earn, earn the, uh, the first down. And they were able to convert almost all those. And, and, and that hurt us. It kept their drives uh, going. It kept them with the ball a lot. They hit the ball a long time in the second half, a lot of plays, a lot of time of possession. Offensively, we came out and uh, sputtered at the beginning. Uh, you know, dropped the ball, had a penalty, and next thing you know, it's third and long. And, uh, uh, and then after that, they, tried, they tightened up the coverage, and uh, we weren't able to get open as much uh, and, uh, and, and make big plays. In the first half, we made those plays. And uh, so, you know, like I said, uh, combination of all those things, we've got to fight through it. You know, we, we, we've identified the problem for the last couple games, just haven't been able to overcome it. So we've got to adjust again and, and, and see what we can do. Coach, how important it is, especially you had all those starters leave last year with all the experience, and plus you have two NFL players that's currently in the league playing. How hard is it to, to adjust on defense? Well, we knew that we weren't going to have this star elite power that we had last year. We had some outstanding players, a lot of guys that uh, made it to the NFL, made it into camps, and, and, and uh, that's saying something about the talent you have. And uh, Right now, of course, we don't have those. We're, we're playing some younger guys, but we've got to continue to get better. Uh, do I think we're far off? No, but I, I think we, we, we have a ways to go, and we haven't proven to do it on a consistent basis. We haven't proven to do it for 60 minutes in a game, uh, and we've got to get better. And if not, uh, you know, we're going to uh, be in these games every single week. And, and, uh, but at the same time, it's a, it's a team effort. You know, we've got to score enough points to win. They've got to stop them when they have to. Our special team's got to play well, uh, and we all have to do better. And coach, when you first come out, I mean, dynamic, explosive, you kind of script the first uh, eight to ten plays? Yeah, you know, we do our homework and we kind of had a beat on them and uh, definitely our plan going into the game worked and we were able to score 31 points on offense in the first half, which is a good first half and a lot of what we did worked and we were able to move the ball. Uh, I don't know if we punted at all in the first half. So things were going well defensively, you know, held them to 14 points, even though they missed a few field goals. Uh, and in the second half, uh, you know, things changed. and. You know, you can look back at it. Uh, I think we've looked back at it over and over again every week because it's happened more than once. Uh, and, we, and we've got to continue to make adjustments and continue to, to do things to put our players in the best position to win and, and just try to fight through it and overcome it. 
And Dowdy had another good game, uh, 28 of, of 44, uh, one interception, but it wasn't really his, his fault on that, that particular interception. No, you know, he's played well, and uh, he distributes the ball well, and, uh, you know, but we can't ask him to do it all. I think, um, you know, there were certain decisions in the second half he didn't make as well, but, you know, when, when the ball's in your hands and it's on your shoulders the entire game, it's going to be tough. So we've got to find ways to run the ball. We've got to find ways to take the pressure off him uh, to, where he doesn't have to do the entire thing himself. Uh, and I think we're going to do that. And uh, we've got to manage the clock a little bit. We've got to control the ball to help our defense and some things that we're going to have to adjust to, to make it better for the whole team. And uh, also, Leon Allen, I saw you on the sideline and it was on Leon Allen. Tell him he needs to be a big back. And for some reason, it, it, hit, it registered with him. No, I thought Leon played well. You know, he, uh, he's been a little nicked up. Uh, he, he, he played well. He ran hard. <laughs> he scored two two uh, two times for us. One time on fourth and one, where we went for it, and he hit it up in there, and it wasn't a huge hole, and he hit it up in there and got yards. And then we spread the field out the next time, and they blitzed, and he made a few guys miss, and did a really good job. Uh, so, and that's kind of his strength. He's physical. Uh, he can get the tough yards when you need it, uh, and he definitely did that for us. And and also in with the offense in the red zone, two for two. Yeah, I thought we did better, and that's an important area. We want to make sure we score points in there. We want to make sure we get touchdowns. Uh, like I said, we, we took a chance on the first half, and we could have kicked the field goal on fourth and one. We decided to go for it. Our, our players wanted to do it, and uh, they found a way to get in the end zone, which was huge momentum for us, and then we scored at the end of the half to, to, to go up uh, to 31 points. Uh, so, yeah, definitely getting in the red zone is important. We've got to score in there, and then on defense, we've got to keep them out of the end zone. And how, how important on defense, Coach, to put pressure on the quarterback? Well, it, it's been hard for us. We've tried different ways to put pressure, and uh, when we blitzed, uh, we haven't been able to get as much pressure as we, we would like either. So, you know, we've got to get a better pass rush. We've got to get guys on the field that have some speed and elusiveness that uh, can rush the passer. Uh, so there's a couple different ways and avenues that we need to go, but definitely pressure in the quarterback has to happen, and we've got to find ways to do it better. And that's, now this week we had a home game against – ODU, how important it is for the team to rally to get back together. Well, it's an important game. You know, they're a good football team as well. They've, they've won a conference game. They've won three games. They have a quarterback who has a lot of experience, who, who throws the ball well. Uh, he's very accurate. And, uh, you know, in their losses, they, they've played well also. So it's going to be a tough game. You know, we, uh, we're right there, uh, but we haven't found a way to get over the hump. So this is a chance for us to uh, compete once again. Uh, try to find a way to win and it's an important game for us. Okay, now, Coach, we're going to go to the Toyota play of the game. Okay, Coach, now the play. Well, I think it was the fifth or sixth play of our first drive, and we just called right 542 flea flicker. And uh, what we have here is we get in a run, a run set. Uh, we had Taewon Taylor split out here to the right. We had Dick Norris to our left. Uh, basically, our, our line came off the ball, sold the run. We turned around, basically handed off the ISO run. Our fullback hit it up in there, blocked the middle linebacker. The tailback went up to the line of scrimmage, turned back around, tossed the ball back to the quarterback. Taewon came in and stuttered, really stuttered that uh, strong safety support in the run, went over the top, and Nick Norris was going to be the outlet coming across the field. And uh, great job of blocking, great job by uh, uh, Ace Wells of getting up in there, tossing the ball back. Brandon caught it, threw it right away for the touchdown, took a hit when he threw it and just great execution by the entire offense. Coach, what was in their defense that you saw that you can get this play in your first eight? Well, we wanted to try to run a few trick plays, and uh, it's always fun to do. And uh, the de this is one we definitely ran in practice. We ran it against our first team defense. We scored on it. So we said we're just going to make the first uh, eight plays. And uh, great job of execution. We knew they were going to bite down on the run. That's a huge run set for us. They did. Taewon did a great job of getting over the top and a great throw for a big, big touchdown. And what coverage were they in? Well, they were in a tight quarters look, which is a look that where they like to support the run with their safeties. And uh, when we hand the ball off, I mean, they're going to support the run. And uh, when we did that, he just came up just for a little bit. Tavon stuttered him, so like he was going to block him, went over the top. He did try to retreat and, you know, got fairly close, but we made a great throw, great catch. He found a way to stretch into the end zone for a big touchdown and got us off on the right, right foot. Okay, Coach, we'll be back to you after these messages. Hey, Hilltopper fans, I know you're hungry for our next home game. And while you're out tailgating with your IGA products, you could be a winner. It's the $6.99 Pick Your Pears deal at Pizza Hut. Pick two medium pizzas and a total of four toppings for $6.99 each. Want two toppings on one and two on the other? Three and one? Get it however you want and on your favorite crusts. Pan thin and crispy or hand tossed, just $6.99 a pizza. Pizza Hut. 
there's a big difference between a network and a community. In a community, you feel like you can do anything because those around you will support you every step of the way. Bluegrass Cellular is a community, a community with 4G nationwide coverage and all the latest smartphones and devices. That enables you to take the people who matter the most with you everywhere you go. Bluegrass Cellular, your community expanded. You were just supposed to buy the couch. What did you do? <laughs> to get the best deal, I had to buy the set. Why did you buy extra things we don't need? You shouldn't have to buy what you don't want. If you just want internet, choose Time Warner Cable's everyday low price internet for only $14.99 a month with no extra products to buy or long-term contract to sign. And it's not a promotional price. You make the call. Choose better. Call today or visit TWC.com now to get everyday low price internet for $14.99 a month. Time Warner Cable. Enjoy better. Hilltopper fans, Scott Waste Services have teamed up with WKU Athletics and Coca-Cola to bring you the Scott Waste Services Recycling Roundup. Please recycle your plastic cups and Dasani water bottles by placing them in the bottle-shaped containers located throughout the concourse of Houchins LT Smith Stadium. With your help, we can reduce the amount of plastic that is sent to the landfill and keep our stadium clean. Thanks, Scott Waste, and remember, Hilltopper fans, good sports always recycle. Go Tops. I like that Passport's right here in Kentucky. That's why I choose Passport. We choose Passport because there's no cost to us. I choose Passport because they helped my mom get the care she needed. We choose Passport because of her. Why will you choose Passport? Call 1-800-578-0603 and choose Passport, a proud sponsor of WKU's Hilltoppers with Heart. Passport Health Plan. We take the time to care. Okay, we made it. Thanks, guys. Are y'all having car trouble? Betsy here? Well, she's seen better days. Yeah, we need some new wheels. Well, you've come to the right place. At Toyota of Bowling Green, we have a wide selection of quality used cars, trucks, and SUVs. And the best part is, if you don't love it, bring it back. We'll take it. Great, you're gonna love it. Hope you don't mind if we pay you in cash. <laughs> Betsy's trunk is full of these. Toyota of Bowling Green. We take care of people. It's the $6.99 Pick Your Pears deal at Pizza Hut. Pick two medium pizzas and a total of four toppings for $6.99 each. Want two toppings on one and two on the other? Three in one? Get it however you want and on your favorite crusts. Pan thin and crispier hand toss. Just $6.99 a pizza. Pizza Hut. Welcome back to the Coach's Corner, presented by Bluegrass Cellular, the Fisher Wireless sponsor of WKU Athletics. Coach in the fourth quarter, there was a scare with Dowdy. You know, yeah, Brandon, uh, at the end of the game, we're, we, we want to try to drive the ball and get a score and, um, you know, call it a pass play. And I think he had a guy open in the flat. He tried to do a little too much, which is uh, what we don't want to do is make him do too much. He held the ball long when he scrambled, got hit and fumbled and took a good shot. But I think he just got the air knocked out of him and uh, he's fine. I'm glad to hear that. Now, uh, German is, has been one of his favorite targets, especially when clutch time. Yes, Joe German uh, does an outstanding job for us. Uh, he's an athletic receiver. Uh, he really understands the position. Uh, he runs good routes. Uh, he's a guy last year was probably our, our biggest contributor on third downs. He made a lot of big catches on third downs in traffic. You know, he plays the slot position, so he's got to catch the ball in there with safeties and linebackers around him, being able to hit him. Uh, so he's a very tough receiver, uh, leads by example, works hard in practice, and uh, does a great job for us. Uh, his leadership skills, like for the other receivers, do the receivers look up to him? Without question, I think him and Willie McNeil are our main leaders. They've been here a long time. They've played a lot. Uh, they both lead by example. I think they both work hard. They practice hard. Uh, um, you know, they practice when they're nicked up, and uh, you know, they definitely display their their want to win, their desire to to be a great player by what they do on the field. And being a slot receiver, how important it is to understand the offense. Well, Joe uh, really understands the offense. Uh, you know, we can move him around a lot, but he's mostly in the slot. And like I said, he'll run a lot of routes in there where he's got to get underneath linebackers, over top linebackers, in between safeties. He has a good feel for it. He's able to catch the ball uh, in, in, in tight windows. Uh, and definitely a very tough receiver and, and uh, does a very, very good job. Okay, now to the feature with Joel German. My name is Joel German. I'm from Fort Myers, Florida. Um, I play wide receiver, and I'm major in sports management. Oh, well, my, I'm a wide receiver. My job is to score touchdowns, what I like to say. But uh, we, we, we're real important, and uh, we catch the ball. 
Cortez now, I guess. Oh, my visit, uh, I came and I, I really enjoyed the place and uh, it felt like family when I came. There was a lot of guys from Florida, so I kind of felt like home. I love kickoff, the beginning, the jitters and all that. Is, I love it. And then, of course, the end when we win. Uh, well, I, listen, I usually just listen to music, and uh, so at first I listen to, you know, kind of pumped up music, and then as we get closer to the game, I listen to a church song to, to get me reminded to let me know who's really first, and then I, I be, I, I'm ready then. Yeah. German has the catch for Oh, Jamarcus Shepard, we were real close. Uh, my first year was actually his first year, and uh, he, was, he was my teacher before, and we just got a real good relationship. And he, he, he's like a big, um, like a mentor to me, so. I want to be on an all-conference team. And I, well, I have team goals more than I do individual goals, but I want to win the conference and off, um, go to a bowl game. And then hopefully make it to the NFL. Just the guys, I love being around the guys, and I'm a football guy, so I, I just love football. I've been playing since I was four years old, so just the whole, the whole atmosphere just makes me, I just love it. Yes, I'm very excited. I was here when the program, when we were, we had kind of rough seasons, and now I have seen the growth, and I'm very excited to be a part of Conference here. Oh, it, because it's, like I said earlier, WKU is like a family, like, you know, uh, the people are nice, they welcome you in, and everybody's nice, like, it's just like a big family, and I feel like it's the place where you want to be, especially being away from home. Go Tops. So glad I decided to shop at Priceless IGA for the game today. You saved so much money. Mm -hmm. We should. When you're part of a community, you feel empowered, like you can handle anything. Because no matter what happens, you have the support of those around you, people who genuinely care. With Bluegrass Cellular's 4G nationwide coverage and all the latest smartphones and devices, you can go anywhere and do anything because your community will be with you, supporting you every step of the way. Bluegrass Cellular, your community, expanded. Get going. Gotta be good. Good? Good. Gross is the goal. How do we do that? I talked to UPS. They'll help us out. New technology, smart advice. We focus on the business and they take care of the logistics. UPS. Good going. We get good? That's great. 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 <laughs> I love logistics. Hey, Hilltopper fans. Starting this season, WKU Athletics is launching a women's fan club to help bring together female Hilltopper fans. By partnering with local businesses, this group will offer female fans unique VIP opportunities and access to exclusive events like a football women's clinic and pregame meet and greets. For more information on how you can get involved, 
Visit WKUSports.com and be sure to wear your red throughout the year. I like that Passport's right here in Kentucky. That's why I choose Passport. We choose Passport because there's no cost to us. I choose Passport because they helped my mom get the care she needed. We choose Passport because of her. Why will you choose Passport? Call 1-800-578-0603 and choose Passport, a proud sponsor of WKU's Hilltoppers with Heart. Passport Health Plan. We take the time to care. I'm so glad I decided to shop at Priceless IGA for the game today. You saved so much money. Mm -hmm. We should... Welcome back to the Coach's Corner, presented by Bluegrass Cellular, the Fisher Wireless sponsor of WKU Athletics. Coach, now we have ODU this week. Yes, we do, and uh, you know it's another home game, and we're looking forward to it. We're look, looking forward to getting back in front of our fans, and it's a chance for us to go out and, and get our first conference win. Uh, we knew uh, coming into the conference, we're going to have to earn our stripes and work for it. And obviously, uh, you know, we've taken a few lumps here, but uh, this is a very good team. Uh, they've played well. Uh, they have a conference win. They've won three games. Uh, they've got a senior quarterback who's played extremely well. He likes to throw the ball around. He's very accurate as, also. Uh, so it's going to be a challenge for us, and uh, we've got to play a full 60 minutes, and we've got to find a way to win the football game. How dynamic are they on offense? Well, like I said, they got an experienced quarterback, kind of like the one we have. He's very good at distributing the ball. He's uh, smart with the football. I think in a lot of the losses they had, they've turned the ball over. Uh, so I think that uh, you know he's a proven winner. He's a leader. Uh, he's got good receivers. Um, and they, they execute and run a, a scheme that's very simple, but they do it very well. So it's going to be a challenge. We're going to have to score points. Uh, it's going to probably be a, a tight affair, but uh, we've got to find a way to win and play hard and definitely play well in the second half, of course, but uh, play a full 60-minute game. How important it is to get our, our first Conference USA uh, win? It's important. You know, we, we got to find a way to get it done, and uh, it's going to be competitive every week. Uh, it's a very good conference. We're, we're, we're happy to be in it. Uh, but we've got to win at home, and uh, to win in front of your fans is important, and uh, we've got to get a win this week. So this week, uh, by looking at the film, what, what kind of things, that, what's important ingredients to win in this game? Well, I think on defense, we've got to control the quarterback, and we've got to find a way to get pressure on him. We've got to find a way to uh, get off the field on third down. We've got to find a, a way to uh, you know, eliminate the big plays, eliminate the, the tempo plays that teams like to run. And then on offense, We've got to execute. Uh, we've got to run the football. We've got to do things to, to definitely get us in the end zone, but take some pressure off the quarterback as well. Okay, Coach. Thanks for watching the Coach's Corner, presented by Bluegrass Cellular, the official wireless sponsor of WKU Athletics. As the presenting sponsor of Hilltoppers with Heart, Passport Health Plan is proud to serve Western Kentucky University and Hilltopper fans across the state with all their health care provider needs. Coach's Corner with Jeff Brom is brought to you by Bluegrass Cellular, the official wireless sponsor of WKU Athletics. Bluegrass Cellular, your community expanded. Interventional pain specialist. Pain is inevitable, suffering is optional. Pizza Hut, home of the big dinner box. Make it great. Taco Bell, Taco Bell's new dollar cravings menu, Taco Bell, because sometimes you gotta live moss. Toyota Bowling Green, we take care of people. UPS. Today's logistics of the games are delivered by UPS. Information about how UPS can put the power of logistics to work for you at thenewlogistics.com and by WKONA. Nowhere to go. The preceding program has been a presentation of the Hilltopper Sports Satellite Network, produced by Hilltopper IMG Sports Marketing. WKUPBS will now return to this channel.